Today we are going to talk about an add-on bundle that offers a random assortment of hard surface tools, rendering tools, lighting and modifiers tools, texture baking tools and much more. And with that you, you get an unparalleled grid based boolean and the draw system, a single click solution to boolean cleanup, modifier presets, tools to add wires and simulate them with one click and also backup tools to help you manage objects backup versions like a pro and much more. Now working with Blender will never be this easier and efficient with this bundle and this bundle is called RAN Tools and P Cutter. So RAN Tools is your one stop shop for tools. It is bundled with a tool for every need be it creation, detailing, presentation or rendering. So if you need the backdrops or lights want to render multiple angles at the same time, want to present your models in the best way possible with clay and wireframe renders, RAN tools got you covered. And with it you get P cutter that allow you to draw perfection with absolute precision using the new P cutter. You can use two grid types, enter sketch, boolean and draw modes and use tools like angle snapping, intersect snapping, mirror and array and more to draw shapes the way they meant to be. You also have a straightforward painless solution for cleaning boolean cuts, no more sliding immersion hassles, you now have precise control via easy to use sliders. And one of the coolest features of the add-on is batch rendering, so you can showcase the best of your art via camera and rendering tools, set aspect ratio, resolution, shutter speed and focal length all from one menu with a single click and with no effort add backdrops and lights. Using batch rendering tools you can create rendering presets and render with different angles, cameras and settings. Also you can generate clay and wireframe renders of your models. You can customize each preset to your liking and use different cameras and resolutions. Also most of the render settings are saved with the preset while only a few are shown in the panel due to the limited space. To change other settings you can simply click the preset to load it and make your changes and then press the update button. You also have the ability to control backdrops, add light setups and interactive camera adjustments. The add-on also offers some powerful curve tools. You can create cables, generate multiple wires, simulate or apply objects on elementary curves to create custom curves. You can create cables and wires easiest way possible using only two clicks. You can convert single wires to multiple in a radial or parallel pattern. You can simulate wires in real time with collision. Also you can put any object onto a curve to create custom cables or coverings. The add-on also offers modifiers presets which is a tool that allow you to save time by storing a single modifier settings or even entire modifier stack as presets. You can load them again with a single click without having to rebuild them from scratch. You can use these presets to create non-destructive meshes from a single vertex or auto-update object fields of modifiers on an active object with previously selected objects and much more. Also when it comes to working with modifiers you can increase your productivity with adjust modifiers feature. You can adjust existing modifiers on the fly directly from the viewport via the boolean pi menu. You can also choose to work professionally and use the backup manager to create and manage backup versions of your objects. You can quickly switch between objects version without worrying about children or associated cutters. Also you can transfer normals along versions to fix shading artifacts. Now for the material tools you get access to a thousand PBR materials from ambientcg.com right from the viewport using the materials library. You can apply clay material over objects while optionally skipping translucent ones. You can toggle the UV shaker texture on and off via the pie menu. 
You can drag and drop materials from a face or object to another seamlessly with the material dropper. You can make small changes in material directly from the viewport via quick adjust. And you can seamlessly set up all PBR textures from directories and subdirectories with a single click. Now for baking textures, you can bake bevel maps with ease and empty normal sockets are automatically found to add the maps. You can bake simple or worn edges masks to enhance material details and you can bake single and multiple textures at the same time even for multiple objects. You can eliminate the tiering task of manually creating and selecting images and leave it all to RAN tools. Now for light groups, you have light grouping tools that let you control and manage multiple light sources together as a group. You can select, delete, dissolve groups with one click and within the groups you can change intensity or randomize color with a single click. And for multiple groups you can isolate one to see its independent effects on the scene. Also the add-on offers the quick append feature so you can effortlessly search and append objects, materials, node groups or even entire collection blazingly fast via quick append feature right from the viewport. Also a flow map feature is added to add flow maps to any texture with one click. It can also be added to multiple nodes at once as well. And there are other features like dice from view, view based mirror, faces to clothes and circular array. The add-on also comes with major updates that add a lot of extra useful functionalities to it. Like the version 2 update that added the ability to align grid to vertex and face mirror for P cutter and the sync modifier integration feature and it added the material library and the material mixing and also the version 3 update which is the largest update for the add-on yet. It added new HDRI's library and advanced word shader and also the fastest cutter mode for P cutter and lastly the asset browser supports for material library. Now if you want to check out this add-on link is in the description. Tell me in the comments below what do you think about this add-on. Thank you for watching and goodbye.